This isn't going to be your typical travel vlog this weekend. Go to Austin, Texas for the IndyCar race. I'll see you in a few minutes. Let's get to it. I'm going to shorten this up a little bit for you guys. A lot of people don't realize you got a lot of cultural offerings at the airport, and this is kind of the walk between the main security and Terminal T. This one's cultural offering is from Zimbabwe. Dreaming so much lately about your face. All right, you guys probably thought we were ahead in a uh, little time lapse this morning. Nah, we're gonna skip it. I just see it on the ground, Austin. Hey, I don't know if I told you that I think you're beautiful, and how I can't wait to hold you. Yeah, you pull me up. We're in Austin, Texas. Made it. Safe flight, no problems, and very rock. Wait for my friend to show up and off we go. You guys enjoy this. This is going to be fun. Everything's alright. We been longing for each other. This is something that I know for sure. It's just something about you. I just want more. Tell me what you want to do right now. Alright, we're going to watch the stadium truck a little later today. This is all the paddock. So here we are in the paddock. Looking around this kind of stuff. We've got a bunch of teams here. People preparing for the race later today and tomorrow. It's going to be awesome. Can't wait to show you guys. Well, we didn't think we were going to get this close, but we did. <laughs> so, kudos to Jamie. Nice work. Thanks for getting all this stuff put together. And yeah, there was a little Powers car right there. And then uh, I think we had Simon Badger right next to him. So, we were really close. This is in between the garage and then uh, we're turning around here. We got the haulers. So, there they are. There's Simon Pagno, Will Power, Joseph Newgarden. And new this weekend, something I'm personally really excited about. Yeah. There's another guy. Off really they go. All right. Get ready for the stadium. Super truck going out on the track. These guys are badass. They are 600 horsepower. Very light truck. It's just going to fly. Pretty incredible how high that turn one is. That's about a hundred feet straight up. It's amazing. But when it comes to her, you better keep it sealed. Don't you dare say a single word, or I will strike you where it feels. You think that using her would get to me? Right now, I know I won't wait. 
everybody would go. So how much is it for you on the pressure out there on the track when you're thinking about this corner and maybe you lost a little bit of time there last time. Are you thinking about that every time you go around? I mean, yeah, of course. Um, you know, the thing is if you if you make a mistake at turn one, you pretty much ruined the rest of the lap. But the next time it comes to turn one, you're like, okay, don't make that same mistake. stuff just to take a second and explain how the paddock passes work so these guys get you in kind of behind the scenes uh, let you into pit lane um, on the outside more like the garages and the team hauler areas great opportunity to meet the guys and actually talk with them for a second so uh, saw a lot of great legends today and got some nice work in too so anyway we're gonna head back into the concert and Oh boy, literally different life choices could be made at this point. Put long corn dog and tots and that price. Holy crap, that's expensive. Man, oh man, it's race day morning. <laughs> We've been a little too hard last night. We're gonna have a fun time today. Might be a little rough at some spots, but we're gonna have a good time. Uh -huh. 
All right, we're here this morning. We have an opening gate yet. We're getting ready to go in just a second. I'm not going to hang out here. We spent a lot of time today. We spent a lot of time here on Friday and Saturday. Race pad is a pretty busy place. We're just about ready to start the race. It's always great to see everybody out. And uh, today we've got a decent crowd. This is the first year they've ever run a Coda. Circuit of the Americas here in Austin, Texas. And to be honest, it's pretty good. They weren't expecting much. Uh, it is a new event. So it'll take a little while to date, build up some data equity with these guys. But uh, so far, so good. So this is going to be a great race. Um, all the drivers have been super awesome this weekend and posing for pictures and generally giving me their time. So I'm hoping that uh, I'm hoping one of the guys that I got a picture with wins. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. We'll see. That's the race. We're gonna head back to the car. Woo! And head inside the air conditioning and see what price. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, turn on those post notifications so you didn't miss any content. See you guys next time.